Hi everyone, welcome to the Sean Allen Films The Educational Series. I'm Sean Allen. This is part 6 of I mean, a 9 part series on the skeletal system. If you haven't seen the last 5 episodes, I suggest you go watch them very soon. In today's episode, we're going to be looking at the bones in the feet and the hands. Let's take a look at the bones in your hand. As mentioned in the last episode, the ulna and the radius are attached to your hand. They are connected to these bones called the carpals. There are eight of these bones. As we move up the hand, we come across the first part of your hands. These bones are called the metacarpals. As you can see in the model, these are not the bones that make up your fingers. They make up the palm of your hand. The bones which are connected to your metacarpals are known as phalanges. These make up the knuckles in your fingers. There we go. Believe it or not, but there are three different types of phalanges. They are the distal phalanx, the middle phalanx, and the proximal phalanx. So be sure to remember these names because it may appear in your next anatomy test. Alright, now let's look at the bones in your feet. Now this may come to you as a shock, but there are some bones in your feet that have the exact same names as the bones in your hands. Which ones? Well, here they are. The bones that make up your feet are also known as phalanges. Don't ask me why, but that's the name they were given. Plus, they are also divided into three parts. Proximal phalanx, middle phalanx, and distal phalanx. Yeah, same as the fingers. The bones that are connected to your toes are known as metatarsals. They are attached to your tarsals. These bones make up your heel. This may be hard to remember. Just keep in mind that your tarsals and metatarsals are in your feet whereas your carpals and metacarpals are in your hands. And just like that, we are finished with the bones in your hands and feet. Let's go over a quick review. Your hands have three different types of bones. They are carpals, metacarpals, and phalanges. Your feet also have three different types of bones. They are tarsals, metatarsals, and phalanges. The phalanges is divided into three sections. The distal phalanx, the middle phalanx, and the proximal phalanx. Well everybody, we have finished the entire skeletal system. We have looked at the skull, the vertebral column, the rib cage, the pelvic girdle, the pectoral girdle, the bones in your arms, your hands, your feet, and legs. In next week's episode, we're going to be looking at how a bone heals. Before you go, be sure to like this video and leave a comment telling us what you thought about today's show. Be sure to also check out Sean's Google Plus page, Twitter, Facebook page, Kink, and Vlog TV. The links are down below. What? Oh! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Well, that's all for today. Until next time, keep on learning. Your hand has three different types of bones. And I completely forgot. <laughs>